Hey, it's Tom Stray here on behalf of Indie Structural Productions once again, uh, doing some work with the brass plating. Uh, basically here, just gluing the pickup plates in place with uh, epoxy glue. And then I'm fastening it in place with the actual pickup screws. Kind of straightforward. But after that, I set to making all the rough shapes uh, with a uh, hobby knife for a uh, scalpel blade. Basically, we would we just wanted a couple of like uh, hurt one to keep like a swirl pattern with uh, just drawing the outline for the swirls and then later going with the Dremel and uh, really engraving those into the brass itself. Seeing as this is more of a scratching the brass sort of thing. But it helps us, or helps myself at least, uh, kind of see a little better what the entire thing will look like. While I do that, uh, Jay is going ahead with his Dremel and rounding out the corners for the pickup plates, making them a little, well, making them look a lot nicer than just pointy, not really that exact rectangles. And after he's cut off all the excess, he goes around and sands the uh, edges so they're not sharp. Once again, very good to keep all fingers as firm and on the tool <laughs> as possible. Now here's that uh, truss rod plate that I was telling you guys about in the previous episodes. And uh, basically I'm going ahead and engraving IP13, seeing as this is the 13th guitar that uh, Indie Star Productions has uh, worked with. Lighting's very fairly bad here, but you'll see it soon. There we go. After that's done, and uh, this is once again at um, my home, back from the cabin. Uh, go ahead and uh, I go ahead and engrave. On the brass work. Sure, this took a long time, but it was well worth it. Everything ended up looking so much better than I thought.
I think I actually got this picture for the bridge from, uh, I googled uh, steampunk design and this was just a small little detail in I can't remember what, I think it was like a steampunk styled Game Boy and I tried to make my own version of it going ahead and engraving on the guitar horns and a lot of very awkward positions and last but not least the pickup plates I just wanted something very simple on these but once again less is more works anyway I hope you enjoyed this video uh, be sure to subscribe for more and uh, I'll see you guys later bye bye